Three former heads of states, traditional rulers, and other distinguished guests joined family and friends at the Muson Center in Lagos for Mr. Akintola Williams' centenary celebration. <laughs> Born on the 9th of August 1919 with little assistance, the celebrant insisted on walking to his seat to a standing ovation. This great man that has touched Nigeria in so many ways, impacted the institutions that regulate our decency and best practice across many professions. Leading the opening prayer, the senior pastor of the House on the Rock churches, Paul Adifarasi, said the present generation of Nigerians should be grateful to have witnessed living legends like Mr. Akintola Williams. As we celebrate your grace on Pa Akintola Williams, in the name of Jesus Christ, and amen. In the first of the three toasts of the night, Former head of state General Yakubu Gowon reiterated that Nigeria should be grateful to have the likes of Pa Williams. The second and third toast by his son, Mr. Shane Williams, and Dr. Christopher Koladi had similar tones. We can say, all of us, with truth, with sincerity, and with total belief in what we say, that these hundred years that Mr. Chancellor Williams has been here, we can say truthfully that everything he has touched has become better because he touched it. Hardly is any birthday celebration complete without the cutting of the cake. That function was conducted by Senator Ibikuni Amosu and surrounded by the celebrant's children and grandchildren. Yeah. 